So you're about to give a presentation and you feel some of the public speaking jitters that come with it, right? That's okay. It's okay to feel a little nervous, a little anxious. You're about to share some information with people in front of you that maybe are your peers or maybe uh, are your supervisors or maybe you're a pastor of a church and you're sharing to your congregation or you're giving a keynote at a conference. There's all types of different reasons that you might have to give a public speech, right? And if you've chosen a career where it looks like that's gonna happen a lot in your life, then it's best if you lean into the skills and tools that can help you become the best public speaker possible, right? So here's one thing that I see a lot of times when it comes to public speaking. That is people prepare really well and they prepare really hard and maybe they have like most of their points written out or they have every word of the talk written out, right? We'll get into later whether you should use notes or not. But a lot of times people go into a talk thinking that, hey, every word I prepared needs to be shared, right? And so what you get nervous about is what if I get up there and I start talking and I forget something? a point or I forget a context clue or something like that. Here's the really good news. As you're going up to speak to your audience, whether it's 12 people or 1,200 or 12,000, they don't know what you're about to say. They might know the direction you're going to go, but they don't know the words that you're going to say. So if you skip over something that isn't a main point, there's really no reason to fear or to get nervous about it because the audience, they don't know that you forgot something. And so you can keep moving forward. And maybe you're in a position where you get to give that same talk again, and you can know, okay, it didn't even matter that I didn't say it, or uh, yeah, that is something I want to make sure that I have in the talk. And here's kind of a bonus part to this tip, right? The fact is, people don't know what you're about to say, and so don't worry about not saying all the right things. But the bonus tip is also this. Anytime you get up in front of an audience, no one is hoping you do bad, right? Everybody is hoping that you're at least just okay. And so they don't want you to bomb. They want you to be enjoyable, and they want to listen to you and be able to root you on and cheer for you as you go. So don't get caught up on forgetting certain lines, certain words, as long as it's not your main point. Because if you're able to kind of grasp that, then as you go and step into whatever speaking opportunity you have next, you're going to have the confidence to know, hey, don't have to say every single thing, just have to make sure my main point comes across well, and your audience will be good with it.